When researching your topic, deciding what not to include is just as important as deciding what to include. For example, let's say you're researching mental health among students. If you search this topic in Summon, you'll find almost 2 million results. How could you narrow this down? You could start by thinking about what you mean by students. Do you mean school, college or university? What type of students are you interested in? Does age matter? What other demographics might be important? Are you interested in students of a particular gender, race or sexuality, for example? How about where they're from? Think about all the variables that could affect your research. Once you have a more specific idea of what you want to focus on, you can use this to revise your search. For example, a search on mental health among female international undergraduates brings back many fewer results than just looking for mental health among all students. You should also consider how far back in time you want to go. Depending on your topic, there may be published research going back decades. You will need to ask yourself, how old is too old? If you found a paper from 30 years ago, would so much have changed since then that it is no longer relevant? How about 10 years ago? or five, or three. This will depend on your topic, so you'll need to decide your own limit. Once you've determined the limits of your search, you can use these to find additional keywords to narrow down your search, or use the automatic filters on Summon or other databases. See our other videos for more advice, or ask in the library for help.